So it's about 8 a.m. in the uh, morning, and so the, the, it's fairly cloudy, but the uh, sun just kind of popped out. So I've got a couple of uh, the panels here on the end that seem to be making power, and actually it looks like the other ones have uh, kicked in as well. At least that one has. This one... Uh, with the flash, fast flashing light is in low voltage uh, protection mode, so it's not making power yet. Uh, neither is that one, nor that one. Those are those three have yet to uh, start making power. So we have three that are. So these three on the end are making power. And if we look down here in the box at the uh, watt meter, we can see that uh, it's making, it's kind of jumping around, but it's over 100 watts currently is uh, being uh, produced and uh, fed back into the grid. Well now it's just it's maybe two minutes later and they have all, all the inverters have seemed to switch into producing uh, power at this point. The sun is still uh, pretty far off to the east and as I say it's uh, pretty cloudy so and it's supposed to rain actually this afternoon so it's going to be interesting to see uh, once the sun is directly overhead, uh, but if it's cloudy, if it's really overcast, what will this thing produce? That's the question. Now you can see it's up to uh, over 200 watts as the uh, sun uh, kind of begins to strike the panels more directly. It's now several hours later, it's uh, mostly cloudy, although the sun is kind of trying to peek through the clouds. I was actually hoping for uh, a little bit thicker cloud cover so that I could see uh, during this middle part of the day how much, how many watts this thing would put out if it was really overcast, but uh, it was raining earlier, but it's, you know, the sun's trying to peek through. So right now we're producing about, uh, oh, maybe 350 watts, 330 watts. It's jumping around a little bit. So that's not too bad, considering that it's uh, pretty well cloudy. And like I say, uh, I'm more interested in uh, what the minimum amount is that can be produced during, uh, let's say you have a day that's cloudy all day long. You know, you have some days that are completely cloudy. Now it looks like the, the sun has kind of really dropped behind a cloud there. And it's dropped down to well, about 350 watts. So that's that's not bad for a cloudy day. And of course this is just the uh, six panels. And once there are 20 panels, it's gonna be really interesting to see what this thing is capable of producing, even on a cloudy day. So what I have here is a uh, portable, it's a handheld uh, clamp meter. And it's gonna be difficult, but I'm gonna go ahead and turn it on and uh, so what I'm going to be doing is reading the uh, input of the DC DC current so if I all I have to do is put that around there and you can see that right now because of the cloudy day we're getting uh, about 2.8 uh, amps coming through there and of course that could go up as the uh, sun 
if the sun would ever pop out from behind the clouds. Uh, let's aim it down there, so about 2.6. And right now it is cloudy. The sun is trying to come through the clouds. Now that one is reading 3. Come to the next one. That one's reading 2.9. And of course this is all jumping around because of the uh, clouds. 2.8, 2.9. So these are all very similar. And then the final one here. So 2.6, 2.7. And again, it's jumping around because uh, the clouds, the sky is moving, the clouds are moving, cloud cover. And at times it uh, is a little bit brighter. And that'll vary from one moment to the next. Now right now, even with it being uh, cloudy, if you look carefully, and I don't know exactly how well it's showing up in the image, below the numbers on the right in the lower right corner, you'll see the word received, and you see the little arrow just to the left of the word received is pointing to the left, and that indicates that it uh, is run, making the meter run backwards. And that's even after supplying the uh, power load to the house because it's going to self-consume first before it sends any power back. So even on a cloudy day right now, I am sending power back to the uh, power grid, which is uh, pretty interesting considering of course that it is uh, it is a cloudy day right now